course, I think uh, this is the only time we are getting it right in Nigeria. Putting the right person at the right track. Uh, the Honorable Minister of Housing, Architect, Minister Dengiwa, is an astute administrator and a great politician. And uh, he put all together to make sure that what he is going to do for the New Hope agenda is to put a team of this nature so that they will be able to give him all the advice that are the you know, what are the hillocks, what are the hiccups, what are the obstructions in the construction industry and how do we provide more houses to Nigerians. I think he's getting it right. And I thank him for being part of this team and we pledge to give him all the support. Earlier on as we have pledged, uh, when he came in, we are still on that and we will give him all the support so that he will achieve his needs. Okay, so please, can you tell us a bit about what you and your team intend to do to make this whole process? We are, we are, we are giving the terms of reference. We are going to follow the terms of reference and make sure that at least we deliver the deliverables. Okay, thank you very much, sir. Yes. Well, you need to know that the Renewed Hope agenda of Mr. President, he has given all the ministers uh, presential deliverables for them to deliver. And amongst, it, among those deliverables is the reform of the housing institutions. All the federal housing institutions need to be reformed. That they need also to upscale the performance of these institutions. And there's also the need to look at the land reform in order to ensure that uh, we made access to land easy for Nigerians. And that they need also to reduce dependency on foreign uh, importation of building materials. So that's why the ministry, under my mid leadership and my honorable minister of state and the permanent secretary, we thought that uh, there is the need for us to form uh, committees of experts, of sector experts, so who can now take each and every one of these aspects. The first one is the housing institutions reform which is to be headed by no other person than Mr. Adesimo Adesimoe, who has been a ex sector expert in that field. We've also taken that of a housing reform team headed by Mr. Dr. Reverend Ugochini. That one, he's a surveyor already, and he has been in the industry and the sector, and uh, I'm sure he's going to contribute a lot to that. We have the building materials manufacturing hubs. Since the government is now thinking of uh, uh, establishing building materials manufacturing hubs, one in each of four different zones of the country. We took Mr. Architect uh, Ware, who has been an industrialist already. Currently, he has an industry which has been which has stayed here for many years, which is the Chibi uh, that uh, do building materials in terms of uh, tiles and granites. We have also chosen Mr. One of the other sector, which is the multi-agency delivery team. That's a Brigadier General Reese, who served at one time the chairman of the Federal Housing Authority of the, of the country. The multi-agency delivery team is to say we can harness all the housing institutions to see that we can upscale their performance to ensure that they work uh, uh, collectively and ensure that uh, we upscale the performance so that for the virtue of Nigerians to have a decent and affordable housing for all. of deliverables, what they expect us to do, the actionable points, and how we could do it. We want them even to give us the, the low-hanging fruit within the next eight weeks so that we can start implementing all those reforms that they have done. At the end of it, we'll now present to the Federal Executive Council some of the, uh, some of the uh, things or some of the issues that need to go to National Assembly. From there, we now proceed to National Assembly to reform most of these institutions, like the Federal Housing Authority that has been established since 1973. Now it's 50 years already. So those bills need to be uh, uh, looked at again by the National Assembly and ensure that they reform those institutions so that uh, the institution can be either partially commercialized so that uh, even the no income, the middle income, the, the, the high income are catered for just in Nigeria. Uh, these are some of the things we intend to do. For the land reform uh, committee 
uh, land reform uh, task team that were doing that, we asked them to collaborate with the Presidential Technical Committee on Land Reforms that has been established 14 years ago for them to see what can they get from that committee in order to come up with a, with a modality to establish National Land Commission. We have charged them to ensure that uh, they reach out to all the stakeholders, most especially the state governors who are the owners of the land in almost, almost all the country, and ensure that even the traditional institutions are involved in the, com in the committees to be members of this so that we have an all-inclusive report that, will be, uh, that, 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 that could be achievable. Red and TV, first-hand real estate channel.